20 years after being a band and then you know releasing what we feel is one of the, the strongest album we've ever made. Um, Show me. Oh, there you go, there you go. You can, you can see what it is, lads. That's it. There you go. Big fine, Mikey. I think the most important thing that you can do when you're a band when there's like so much political kind of uncertainty going on is to ignore it forget about it Westlife playing Wembley Stadium is for everybody to take their mind off of that mm. including us That's a good point you know it's got you know let them do with that we do what we do let the politicians we play do Wembley the politicians we play Wembley the problem that. is the politicians aren't doing what they're supposed to be doing That's over here we'll still be playing Wembley Westlife is the night out you have after a stressful week at work you know forget Brexit and come for a night out at Wembley Stadium <laughs> I think if we can just be someone's fun night out mm. to get away from whatever it is they're going through um, then that is um, sort of a pleasure to be able to give massive, that to people, yeah, you know. Do you know what, real quickly, though, the relationship between British and Irish people has never been better. It's never been stronger in, in so many years. So I don't think that's going to change. That'll, you know, we, we've, we've, you know we're, we're kind of good friends. We're closest neighbours. Mm -hmm. And the backstop, that will sort itself out. Well, it has to, so let's not go there. <laughs> it suddenly became very, very real, you know, walking in the door, um, if you call that a door, it's a very big door. Um, <laughs> And just seeing this place, um, I've personally never been here before. So just to look around and, you know, we have a feeling of what it's like to do a stadium gig because we've played um, Croke Park back in Dublin and Ireland a few times. But to reach that level in the UK, you know, um, it's actually quite emotional because we've been, you know, we've had a huge relationship with the UK for 20 years or more now. And I suppose when we got back together, one thing we wanted to do was achieve new things and get bigger and better instead of just looking back and being nostalgic. Uh, we wanted to break new records or whatever. And this really for us is a, is a completely new stratosphere to get into in the UK to play stadium. We had to pinch ourselves today. We really did. And when, when it was suggested that we do this place, it was like, this would be incredible. So it is a once in a lifetime moment for us and for the fans. And we've been lucky enough through the years to, you know, have those big songs, thankfully, like Flying with the Wings or the the fun times when we did Comic Relief, we did Uptown Girl and World of Rome, all those big things. So yeah, next August is gonna be one hell hell of a night. Yeah, I think the time away actually did a lot for us individually, you know, because you had to learn how to stand on your own two feet. You know, we were we were babies, like we were like teenagers when we started Westlife and we didn't know anything but having you know, the lads around you and, and kind of being a band. We didn't know what it was like to be an individual. I think the best thing for our career that we've ever done is split up. Um, and I, I, what, I, what, I mean that, what I mean by that is, yeah, you know, we would not be standing there today announcing that we're playing Wembley Stadium if we didn't split up. Um, and I think that um, the, the, the lesson that we learnt is that moving forward, our plan is slightly different to that, you know, more sort of one-off situations, you know, we're around for a little while, but we're not going to be around all the time, every year, album, concert, album, concert. Um, so this feels really special to us and we savour every single moment. The tour we just done, we savoured every moment because we know that we're not going to be doing it every year.